Tom Weisberg has the latest. The suspect in this case is now being held here in the Clark County Jail on $10 million bail. He reportedly told officers that his life is over and he has no reason to live. According to court documents, Officer Dustin Godshall had just stopped a vehicle at 11.30 Monday morning. Court documents state the driver of that vehicle, later identified as James Todd Sapp, leaned out the window and without any warning started shooting. By 11.38, officers from across southwest Washington raced to help Officer Godshall after a 911 caller reported shots fired. We got a code 33. Officer down has been shot. Prosecutors now say Officer Spittle in critical condition, but today doctors upgraded him to stable condition. For his fellow officers, it is the news they have been praying for. He'll have a you know long recovery, but we'll all be there for him through all the stages. Today, we are uncovering investigated by the FBI. Newly obtained court records show SAP is linked to a white supremacist group. Detectives say he has a large tattoo of a swastika and the words white pride. I've learned that the vehicle SAP was driving had two different license plates on it, and one of those plates came back as stolen. The vehicle SAP was driving, police say, was actually registered to his wife, and detectives now confirm that they've recovered the suspected weapon used in the shooting. Officer Godshaw was able to return fire, police say. The vehicle SAP was driving ended up crashing, and he was taken to jail. As SAP appeared in court, more than a dozen officers did too, to show Officer Godshaw. Come together and that we're here for Officer Godshaw and his family. We have been able to confirm there was another person in that vehicle with the suspect in this case. However, detectives tell me he has not been charged, but they say they're investigating. Brent, thank you. And